Agus Wade and welcome everyone to Agus Wade back at Garden with me, Michel Jimus Wade. Of course, in this video feature, I'm gonna encourage you, of course, to grow cucumbers in your backyard garden and not just in the ground but in a shallow planting space. Of course, if you remember that I told you Hurricane Maria affected Dominica tremendously and one of the things that happened in Dominica is that we lost a lot of our agricultural products. We lost a lot of our crops, our fruit trees, our forest trees, we lost a lot of our trees. But in this video feature, I would like to encourage you that you should not lose hope because the trees, they are growing back. Trees are one of the most resilient things after a disaster. And of course, this is a perfect example of in the backyard garden. I planted this cucumber somewhere in November, December, and of course, they're doing pretty well. I took the risk because I've never grown cucumbers in such a shallow space. As you can see, this is merely about four inches in depth. And of course, they're doing pretty well. So much so that there's one cucumber pretty soon it's ready to harvest this one right here pretty soon it's time to harvest it of course i'm going to show you some of the other cucumber plants that are doing pretty well and the fruits they're sending forth in this planter that i'm doing right here in my backyard garden of course you might have remembered that this is the greenhouse if you have not let me just tell you this was the official greenhouse but so far i have not gotten a chance to repair it and also i just decided I'm going to let the cucumbers take over that area. If you notice already that the cucumbers are starting to vine all on the PVC pipe. What I've also noticed is that it's better, it's much better if you allow your cucumbers to hang. This cucumber right here, as you can see, is hanging. What I decided to do, I decided to allow my cucumbers to go upward so the fruit can hang down. And I have noticed that it grows better when it's hanging down. Of course, I have tried growing it on the ground before and I can tell you it's... it's I don't like it honestly because what I notice is that some part of the cucumbers, if you've noticed a cucumber is green and white on certain parts of it, like one part of it is extremely white or light green and dark green, that's those which are grown on the ground. So if you've noticed that they are completely green and well shaped, then those are the ones which are hanging. What I've also noticed is that there's a reduction in the curve of the cucumbers when they're hanging instead. Because when they're growing on the ground, something might be in their way and cucumbers need space to grow. If it is that something is in their way of growing, they will divert or they will have a bend or a curve so that they can grow. What I've also noticed and what I, or what, I, what I've also noticed and would like to encourage you about is that if you're growing your cucumbers and you're using wire fencing, please try to supervise your cucumber to ensure that the cucumber itself do not grow between the fencing because that can actually cause it to grow deformed. So please ensure that your cucumbers have a lot of space, free space to hang and grow. So now let me just show you some of the other cucumbers growing right here on this raised bed, literally a raised bed, which is about four inches deep with soil. Of course, I'm going to start on right here. As you can see, some of the cucumbers, they're very low to the ground, so I can already anticipate that would be a problem. As I just said, it's better that they hang. As you can see, this one have a lot of hanging space, so it's hanging off the waist bed. But these two, they are pretty close to the ground, so I have to find a way to ensure that they stay off the ground. And most likely, what I might do, I might try to elevate them as they're growing, or put some wire or rope so that they could hang like this rather than like this. Here's another. They're doing pretty well right there now this is a good example as to well, not this one i'll show you just now right it's a good example where you should try your best to ensure that your cucumbers do not grow in this space here because if this cucumber was right there then it will grow and expand around the wire and that might cause it to grow funny okay here's another well not another there's two more right there and here's another one close to the ground oh i did not see that one here's one right there doing beautifully and i would like you to see from far how small these plants are and they're already producing cucumber watch this this is a dasher cucumber i tried growing other cucumbers and i can only testify and say for a fact that the dasher cucumbers are the best they are very very productive plants so i'd like to encourage you of course if you're gonna try to grow your own cucumber try to grow the dasher ones now here's the cucumber I was telling you this cucumber right here was actually growing right in there just growing like this so I had to monitor it and as it was growing out, I had to pull it out. And you can already see they have a curve compared to these which are just growing long. This one had something in it way. It could sense that something was not right. So you could see here right here that it have a curve. So that is why I would like to encourage you of course, please try your best to allow your cucumbers to hang. Now you see this space right here where they're growing upwards, the cucumber, the vine is growing up. And when it starts, when this one, if it's pulling it properly, 
the skill bar right here will hang nicely they will all hang nicely so i'd like to encourage you of course please try your best to grow your cucumbers do not worry too much about the space that you're planting in because as i told you this is merely about three to four inches very very shallow and it's doing pretty well i must admit that the soil is very compact because the roots have taken all over and I, what I have to actually do also is add some compost material and some rabbit manure but I'm not going to do it until I harvest or do my first harvest of cucumbers because I don't want the plant to focus too much on growing but I, instead I need the fruits to focus on growing. As I conclude I'd just like to encourage you please try your best to grow your cucumbers in your raised bed or in a container because after all dasher cucumbers are very productive. Remember guys the backyard garden in some ways will keep the doctors away and agris way these out. Done it right, or you wasted your life. 